Good day, Martin. Good day. What do you have for me today? Uh, a box. Go on then. Let's crack, crack to it. Ooh, Barracuda. I see a lot of Barracuda branding on Tenkate World Superbike Machines. It's funny, though. Funny, though. Yeah. And so, oh, I know what these are, because I've used these a lot myself, or similar items. So, for the good people, Martin, quickly explain what these are. So these are brake and clutch lever protectors mm -hmm. for your motorbike. Okay, now these specifically, I believe, are for the Yamaha R6. Yeah, so we're going to fit these to our long-term Yamaha um, and, uh, and see what they're like. I'll get them out. Okay. It's, it's like Christmas, but in November. <laughs> Stop reminding me how close Christmas is, for the love of Pete, please. So, some nice, nice packaging. Yeah, he's got you. See that little, that extra, little, that little thing he's got you. Okay. So, some nice Barracuda racing branding. Branding. Yeah. Some washers that fall off. A little ring. Very nice indeed. Yeah. Now I have come across some different ones of these before and I have occasionally come across problems when it comes to fitting them to standard handlebars. Ah, do you mean as in when you put them in they fall out? Uh, as in you can't fit them without drilling out? Okay, yeah. That's where these little jobbers come in. Oh right. So these are the adapters, specifically these ones are for the Yamaha, you can get them for the Honda, um, the Suzuki as well, they vary in price, um, but these ones are for, for our yam. Um, so basically, you can just screw these in mm -hmm. to the end, and then you can uh, take this bolt bit off and screw it on as well, uh, sort of straight into it. All right, so that shank comes off, yeah, and then you use one of those there, yeah, and it goes in. And oh, okay, yeah, good because again, um, some, some, some have this option, some don't, yeah. Um, but these ones do. Yeah. Uh, what other bikes are these available for, Martin? Uh, so these are for Honda, Yamaha, Suzuki, Kawasaki. They're a universal protector, mm -hmm. so they'll go on pretty much anything. Right. I mean, uh, I've got to say, um, I've used these on pretty much all of my bikes. Now, there is a reason for this. Yeah. Um, a few years ago, I had a Panigale 1199 as a long-term machine. Right. Thank you. And I did actually uh, fit a set of these. Now, uh, the idea was that a lot of people like to emulate race bikes, whatever, and obviously these became mandatory in most race series. Yeah. Um, and I did get a tiny bit of grief off the boys in the office going, oh, look at you, these silly protectors. However, literally a day after getting hounded about it, um, <laughs> I was just, uh, I was riding down um, the A36 minding my own business and a car, I just suddenly realised that a car coming towards me yeah. was veering into my lane and when I say veering I mean really veering now uh, as an aside it turns out that the woman at least I think it was a woman mm -hmm. it could have been either, could have been either way um, was turning around shouting at the kids in the back of the car okay, and it yeah. veered across and I took avoiding action but a wing mirror just clipped yeah. that that could have actually been my brake lever. Yeah. Um, additionally, I've had a couple of close calls, funny enough, with other bikers when we've been when we've been uh, going past traffic <laughs> in a, a small space and met someone coming the other way. So um, they they can, apart from looking race cool and being handy if you go on track and you happen to be battling with your mates or whatever, giving you a bit of added safety. Um, from my own experience. I mean, I'm not going to say it definitely would, uh, the wing mirror would have definitely hit my brake lever, but there's a blinking yeah. good chance it might have yep. done. Um, you might have noticed, obviously, these look like they're both for the same one, but these are obviously designed to be... Ah, to go the other way around. To go the other way around. Actually, that's... 
that's still that, going. Oh, because because yeah. yeah, but you can turn these round. Yeah, basically. Yeah, yeah that's, those that's what I get. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, because initially there you made yourself look a bit silly. Yes, yeah, sorry. <laughs> some grub screws in there. So. Yeah. Um, so the po- the whole point being, these can be taken apart, yeah. turned around. Yeah. So you know, so if you do for some reason break the one on your brake lever, which is yeah. the most important one, you yeah. could always cannibalise the other. In fact, looking at it in close detail now, I didn't need to take any of that off. I just needed to Allen key those grub screws out and yeah, flip around. But there yeah. we go. That's right. Um, okay, now hit it's us. Not like this is going on the internet or anything. So <laughs> it really. Now uh, hit us with the price, mate. Uh, so seventy nine, uh, seventy nine, ninety, including the VAT for these. So that's each. Each. Each one, and then the fit in. So the about one hundred and sixty quid for the pair. Yeah, which is fairly on par with things, if not a little bit cheaper. That is ballpark, um, I would say, but I do like the quality of them. They do look very nice. And where do the lovely people go if they want a set so, of these? Uh, SP Engineering are the UK importer. The exhaust dudes? Yes, the exhaust dudes. Oh, okay. So um, they, they will be able to, we'll put a link mm-hmm. here, um, and they'll, you'll be able to buy them from there. Oh, right, so they have like a Barracuda shop, do they? Yeah. So, yeah, uh, so, so they, they do a lot more than so this yeah, then? Yeah, uh, so they'll do tail tidies. Uh, Protectors, bobbins, um, yeah, paddock stand bobbins. Um, oh God, so much stuff. <laughs> it escapes me. Um, but yeah, if you if you pop on there, they're the UK importer um, and distributor for, for all Barracuda stuff. So you'll only be able to get it from them guys. Right. Um, and these come in various different colours. So you've got uh, I think it's black. Oh, well, obviously these are black. Uh, blue, silver, gold, green, and red. Right. Okay. Um, so and that goes with most of the other accessories as well. So if you've got a red bike and you want to match it all up. You can. You can, yeah. Gotcha. All right, mate. Brilliant. Thank you very much indeed.